welcome back to the Moran family. So today's video is going to be what I got my kids for Christmas. This is also going to kind of be like a gift guide because I do have three girls that range from different age groups. So you can kind of use this as a gift guide for your child if you're looking for ideas on what to get them for Christmas. So I do have a newborn. I also have a two-year-old who turns three days before Christmas and then I have a six year old who turns seven next month so i basically have a newborn three year old and seven year old so hopefully this video is helpful for you guys if you're looking for like ideas on what to get your kids for christmas but with all of that being said let's go ahead and jump into this video so i'm gonna go ahead and start off by sharing my newborn's things i don't really have too much for her just because she's a newborn so she doesn't really need any toys i might go out and buy her a few more things just so she has things to open on christmas so i might buy things like extra clothes um, maybe some extra like burp cloths an extra pacifier clip so just things that i know she like can use right now because like i said she's a newborn so she doesn't need like toys and all of the extra things yet so i only have one thing to share with you guys for her and that is actually a love every play kit if you haven't heard of love every i highly recommend them they have play kits from kids ranging from like newborn all the way to like toddler stages i will say this was gifted to us so i just want to let you guys know that but i genuinely do love love every we have two of their play kits aurora has one of their play kits and then my older daughter layla has a play kit as well and then my baby she has their baby play gym she's only like a week old as i'm sitting here filming this so she hasn't played with the play gym yet but i'm so excited to set it up because it's pretty awesome so this play kit right here is called the looker and this is for weeks 0 to 12. so here's what the play kit looks like and then there's just a whole bunch of like toys in here so i'm gonna go ahead and look at this card to use as a reference so it comes with oh this is so pretty it comes with a mobile and it has a lot of colors on it and then it has black and white which is really good for like newborns so you can flip this mobile both ways silicone rattle with removable ball <laughs> the ball fell out already here is the ball and it's a rattle and you can stick it right here in the middle black and white cards there's just a bunch of different cards and then you can also you can also put the cards in this little pouch as well and then you can stand this up so your baby can look at all of the different cards there's black and white mittens in here so there's just little mittens there's a little wooden book here's the little wooden book so it just has pictures on it and what i really like about love every's play kits is that all of like their books all of their toys most of them are wooden which is really good because kids can be really rough with their toys so i know for a fact these toys are going to last and i can pass them down to like all of my children and i know they'll last for like years to come and then the last thing that is in this i'm not really sure what this is because it doesn't say on the little book oh it's actually a mug i am always down for a new coffee mug i I'm obsessed with collecting mugs. This is so cool. It says the days are long, but the years are short. Amen. If you're a parent, that could not be any more true. So that's really cool that they threw a mug in there for mom. So now let's go ahead and move on to my two-year-old daughter, Aurora stuff. So the first thing that I got her is a little like dress up thing. So here's what it looks like. So it's a little like princess cape. And then it like ties around ties around their neck it has a hood on it and then it goes down to like their ankles the girls are so obsessed with dressing up like whether it be like halloween costumes or like 
superhero costume princess things. They just love dressing up. So I know they will get a ton of use out of this. And I will leave links down below in the description as always if you guys want to check any of this stuff out for yourself. The next thing that I got Aurora is a play silk. I'm not going to open up this one because I don't want to mess it up because it looks so pretty in here. But I'll put some pictures right here of the stuff that I'm not going to be opening up so that way you guys can get a better look of it. But it's literally just a play silk. My girls like to sometimes tie them around their necks and use it as a cape. Sometimes they tie it on to like a little wooden princess wand that they have and then they use it as like a fairy wand. They like to swing them in the air when they dance. So there's just a ton of uses out of this. They've even like put this on the floor before and then they had like a little tea party. So there's just so many uses that your child can get out of this. I also got her a ton of Play-Doh. We used to have a huge Play-Doh stash in our house but we had to throw them away whenever we moved from Hawaii to California. So we don't really have too many Play-Dohs in the house. We have about maybe like four different colors. So I figured I would get the girls some more. And I'm kind of struggling to open this, but there is a lot in here. I also got her a giant squishy. My kids are obsessed with squishies. I don't know why, because you literally just like squish it and then you just watch it rise. I don't know why they like it so much. Maybe it's satisfying. I have no idea, but they're obsessed with them. So I got Aurora a ginormous strawberry because she loves strawberries if i let her she will just go to town on an entire pack within five minutes so i got her the strawberry one this learning resources counting cookies my mom actually has this at her house and every single time we go over there aurora is just so drawn to this toy for some reason she always plays with it so i figured i would get one for our house so it comes with the cookie jar and then all of the cookies have a number on the bottom and then on the top part of the cookie it has the correct number of chocolate chips so this is really good if your child is starting to learn how to count another thing that i got aurora are some headphones i do plan on getting her an ipad but i'm waiting for all of the black friday sales so that's why i don't have that yet but i figured i would get her some headphones that way whenever we're like on a long car ride she can watch some movies in the car she currently has the i think it's called like the amazon fire tablet i'll have that one linked down below as well so she uses that one but you can't get YouTube on it for some reason. So she's always stealing her sister's iPad. And then it's just this big ordeal. They fight over the iPad. So I figured I would get Aurora her own. So that's why I got her these headphones. So here's what the headphones look like. It's in this really pretty like teal mint color. And then it has lavender on it. And these just fold down so easy. So you can throw these in like your diaper bag or your child's backpack and you can take them on the go. These are also toddler sized as well, so I know they'll fit her head. Aurora is two, turning three, like I said, so these are perfect for her age. And these also have a volume control switch as well. That way you don't have to worry about your child like blaring the movie or whatever it is they're listening to. You don't have to worry about that at all. So these are toddler proof, which is really nice. Another thing that I got Aurora is some hair barrettes. She wears these all of the time. These are the ones that she wears in my videos. These are amazing. They don't slip out of her hair. They don't like tug at her hair, anything like that. We don't have any issues with these. So I always buy these because they come in a million different colors. So here's just some of the colors come in a lot and like i said they don't slip out of your child's hair they don't pull their hair they're just really nice and aurora kind of has fine hair as well and these don't slide at all the last thing that i got aurora is by melissa and doug and this is their fold and go wooden stable it comes with four houses it has sliding stable doors a folding corral it has a carrying handle and then it opens all the way for like easy access so here's what it looks like so now moving on to my daughter layla who is six years old about to turn seven i also got her a giant squishy as well but hers is a giant cake slice 
This is so cute. I love the rainbow colors and then it has a bunch of like sprinkles on top. Also got Layla one of those like dress up play capes, but hers is blue. I'm not gonna open up that one since I showed you guys Aurora's. I also got Layla a play silk as well, but hers is blue. Next thing that I got Layla is a like bracelet necklace kit. So here's what it looks like. So it comes with little scissors. It comes with, I'm not sure what these are, maybe to make like a headband. It comes with the string. It comes with a little clasp. So this is just like a full kit, everything you need. Here are the beads. It comes in this carrying case as well to keep everything organized. The other thing that I got Layla is a wooden coffee set. So here's what it looks like. So it's kind of like a little mini Keurig. I thought this was so adorable. My girls have a little wooden kitchen, so I'm always getting them like new things for that. Layla actually asked me for a coffee set, and when I saw this one, I knew I had to get it because it's just so cute. It's in like a teal mint color, and then it has pink. It comes with the little mugs. It comes with little wooden spoons, and then it comes with milk. It comes with sugar. It comes with a little coffee menu and then it also comes with like the little coffee pod So I think this is just so cute because it looks like a mini Keurig. I also got her some play-doh as well So we have a lot of play-doh now So here's what Layla's look like both of the boxes are different colors So these are kind of like darker and then the one that I got Aurora is like pastel colors so I plan on giving these to the girls but they can always just share their Play-Doh. So we have more than enough now. Also got the girls these little like rolling pins for their Play-Dohs. So there's just a green one, a blue one. I think I'm gonna give the green one to Aurora and then the blue one to Layla. And then the roller is silicone, so nothing will really stick on it. I also got Layla a Barbie Chelsea doll. I got one of these for Aurora too, but it got back ordered, so it's not gonna get here for another couple weeks. Hers is a different girl. I'll put a picture right here so you guys can see, but it's just a little Barbie doll, and then it comes with the pony. So the next couple things that I have to share with you guys are things that I got for both Aurora and Layla. First thing is by the brand Lee Toy Van, and this is like a little popsicle set. How cute are these little popsicles? They're called ice lollies. How adorable are these? And these are wooden too, so I know they're going to last. And then it also comes with, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it also comes with a little wooden stand for the lollies, so you can just stick them in the hole on the stand. The next thing that I got them is by Tender Leaf Toys and this is their chocolate birthday cake. This is also wooden as well. I try to stick to wooden toys because like I said, they just last a lot longer. So here's what the birthday cake looks like. It comes with candles and then it comes with like a little topper. Next thing is also for their kitchen as well. This is by the brand Tender Leaf Toys, and this is their mini chef birdie tea set. There's 12 pieces in here. How darling is this tea set? I saw this and I immediately like placed an order and I bought it because it was really low in stock. I've been wanting to get the girls a tea set for the longest, but I just haven't found one that I like. I'm gonna just give you guys like a sneak peek of this because it's just, it's so cute. So here's the little tray to put like the teapot and the little saucers and stuff. It's just so cute. I cannot wait for them to play with this. I know they're going to love it. So in this set, you get a cupcake, a tea bag, two cups, saucers, two teaspoons, a milk jug, and then the little round tray that I showed you guys. I also got the girls this little cash register. This is by the brand Smallfoot. Again, it's wooden. So it comes with the little cash register, it comes with some money, and then it also comes with a little credit card. I figured since I've been buying them a lot of stuff for their kitchen, they would want a cash register. That way they can play like grocery store and they can just really have 
fun. So here's what the cash register looks like. I'm not gonna open all of the little pieces, but here's what the register looks like. It's so cute and it's so tiny. So I know it'll be perfect for their kitchen. The next gift that I got for both of the girls are these 3D magnetic building tiles. This is by the brand Picasso Tiles. So here's what it looks like. There's a hundred pieces in here. So there is a lot. The box is pretty heavy. When Layla was going to school in Hawaii, the classroom had these and she loved them. She was always playing with them and you can pretty much build anything. The last thing that I have to share with you guys is for both of the girls as well. And this is also from Love Every. This is their block set. This is perfect for ages, children ages 18 months and up. I haven't even opened it all the way because it's just ginormous, but I wanna share it with you guys because it's so cool. So it comes with this carrying case where you can throw all of the blocks in. And then it also comes with a like play guide that shows you what you can build out of your blocks and you can build a lot of things with this set. So you can sort shapes, you can pretend play with people, you can build upwards, you can sort the blocks, you can make patterns, make a domino trail, make letters, you can put magnets together, you can drum, you can build a car, you can load the blocks in the car, you can do bead threading, you can sort with colors, you can build a house. There is literally so many things you can do with this block set. So having this play guide is really cool because it shows you all of like the different things you can do and how you can do them. So this is an amazing block set. So here, it's so heavy. Here is the block set. So here's what the top part looks like. So as you can see, it has the cutouts right here. That way, if your child is a little bit younger, like Rory, this is really nice for them because they can sort the blocks by shape. And then the lid is actually magnetic as well. So you don't have to worry about the lid like falling off. And then there's just so many blocks in here. And there's little wooden peg people in here. There's like these cylinder ones. There's triangles in here, round ones in here. You can put like the little stick through the holes right here. Well, obviously I can't do it because the blocks are in here, but you can stick this all the way through like that. Just kind of use your imagination here. And then you can put this on the side just like that. And they're magnetic as well. So that's really cool. So you can put this through the hole and then you can put the lid back on and then you can use this as a car. So there's just so many different like things you can use this block set for. There's also one that has a string so you can like pull the car along. There's just so many things you can do with this. This would be a really nice set if you're looking to get somebody's child something for Christmas. This would be so nice. Well, that is actually everything that I got my girls for Christmas for 2020. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it gave you some gift ideas for your children. Like I said, I will have everything linked down below and I will also have last year's gift guide linked down below so you guys can check out that video as well. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the Moran family and make sure you hit that bell. That way you guys always get notified every single time we upload. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.